everyone welcome back to my channel i'm florence i'm wearable <laughs> how are you guys doing good people are doing great yes guys today's week is all about telephone wire short bob braided wig yes guys telephone wire short braided wig so guys before we proceed with the the video i would really like to appreciate all my subscribers i say thank you for your support thank you for supporting your girl i really appreciate you all thank you all and for those of us that are just tuning in for the first time you are welcome i appreciate you all for tuning in please don't forget to subscribe hit the red bell written red wall written subscribe click on it and turn on the bell notification to get notified each time I upload a new video. I appreciate you all. Thank you for supporting your girl. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I say God bless each and every one of us. So, guys, the first thing I did was to go in with a crochet. I would do single braids. I won't be braiding it all the way. Braid it like half, depending on the length of where you want the braids to, to to get to. So I just wanted the braids to be little, so, so that the remaining end will be for the the telephone coil I'll be making. So after braiding it, I tied it. You can see, look at the way I'm doing it right now. I tied it to ensure that it doesn't come to loose. So this is the braided. This is the way it's looking after filling up that portion at the back. So I'm going in right now to just trace out the particular side I want to do the cornrow. That's the feeding braid. I'm just sectioning it out. It's going to be two layers. So the one at the bottom and the one at the top. So I'm just sectioning it out right now. Since we are not using closure, so I'm trying to create a kind of line that will be a starting point for me to start doing the first layer. Just watch what I'm doing and you will really understand what I'm doing. I'm just trying to get this, the midpoint. I'm trying to get the mid the midline of the of the mannequin head. So I have to center the the upper part of the layer of the feeding braid. Usually I start at the middle of my cornrow you can see i'm starting i'm not starting from the front i start at the midpoint right there that way i will know how many braids on each side of the how many braids i will have on each side so right now we'll just start crochet crocheting on on that line that will be the that's the midpoint right there after which I will come to one side and do. I will know how many break rows or feeding braids I have on that side. I will do the same number on the other side. I'm just showing you now that I've sectioned the, the braiding here so as to be easy for me. As I'm braiding, I'll just be taking it and doing the feeding braid. So basically, that's just what I'm doing right now going in with the feeding braids. I wanted it to be long so I'm just adding adding more hair just to make it longer to get I want everything to be at uh, uh, even at the same length with the other ones so just adding in braids so as to be at the same length with the single braid I've already done. Remember, I said that I'm tying it, so I just have to tie so as not to unravel. So, this is what I mean by starting at the midpoint. So, I will know how many braids I will do one side, count the cornrow, and ensure that it's the same on the other side. You don't want to have we want it to look similar, not really, not having more on one on one side and 
the other side the smaller side so we want it, we want it to be of the same number of three corn rolls on each side basically i've did the appreciating i'm going in with the braiding here starting with a little piece after which i will now start with the feeding braids So I've done, I've done the I've finished with the first layer. So I'm going in now with the top. That's the second layer. That's the, the one at the top. Still doing the same crocheting, tracing a line and crocheting on it. I did three off camera already, so I'm just continue tracing, crocheting, and doing the feeding braid. So guys, um, I'm done doing the, the feeding braid, so it's time for us to do the telephone wire coils. So if you notice I'm twisting this, I'm twisting it. If you don't twist it, I just, you turn the, the yarn around the braiding hair like that, it's not going to be smooth. So the purpose of this um, telephone wire is to be smooth. Unlike the other coils that we do, you just, you know, you fold it together and you twist. But for telephone wire, you have to twist the braiding hair first before you use the, the yarn to, to run across it. If you just coil without twisting the braiding hair, it's not going to look neat. So the purpose of twisting it first is for it to be very, very neat. Have to twist it if you want to make telephone wire uh, coils. I'm just saying for the telephone wire coils for you to be neat and smooth, you have to twist it first before using the yarn to run across it. Just watch what I'm doing, you understand what I'm saying. I will twist it first. You can see, guys, I have to twist it first. I'll be doing that each on. I'll be doing on the single braids. I'm not taking two. If you take two, it's not going to come out nice at all. The coils will loosen up. But when you, when you do it one at a time, the coils will be defined. But if you take more than one, the coils is just going to be loose because you'll be unraveling two two braids at the same time and this time once we take out the the the, uh, the coils after the bit in hot water the coils will still retain the way it is and once you take two braids you know you unravel everything so i'll be doing each one like that so i'm done doing the the coils telephone coils each on the on the braids the next i'll be doing right now is to dip it in hot water let's i forget if you have watched the video up to this point and you've not subscribed what are you waiting for support your girl join the family support and always come and watch us i post videos every week but due to i'm in school right now guys yes that's why i've not posted for a while right now it's kind of tough I'm in school and it's you know school and doing YouTube is kind of tough. That's why I'm not been really posting. I say I have to do this. I just have to do this. Guys, you can see the way it's looking right now. See how beautiful it is. It's so easy. 
the most important thing is make ensure that the, the the telephone wire coils is being twisted. You twist each of the braids. If you take more than one, it's not going to be defined. The coils will be so rough. This is it right here, guys. Please support your girl. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the not bell notification to get notified each time I upload a new video. God bless you as you do so. Thank you all. Appreciate you. Thank you all. Bye.